Have you ever pondered the intricate dance between cancer and the nervous system? How these two seemingly disparate entities, one a destructive disease and the other the body's communication superhighway, are intertwined in a complex relationship? Yes, you heard that right. The story of how scientists discovered the interaction between cancer cells and the nervous system is as fascinating as it is groundbreaking. So without further ado, let's delve into this captivating saga. The tale takes us back to the 19th century, a time of scientific exploration and discovery. It was then that the first observations of cancer cells interacting with neurons were made. Yet the true nature of this interaction remained shrouded in mystery for years. The concept of cancer cells and neurons merely communicating was far too simplistic. The reality, as researchers would later discover, was far more complex and dynamic. Fast forward to the present day, where the emerging field of cancer neuroscience is shedding light on this intricate relationship. Scientists have found that not only do cancer cells communicate with each other through electrical activity, but they also co-opt the nervous system for their own benefit. It's a bit like a rogue agent infiltrating a top-secret agency, using its resources to further their own nefarious agenda. But how exactly does this happen? How does cancer form these alliances with the nervous system? The answer lies in the active role of nerves in promoting cancer growth. It's been discovered that nerves actively seek connections with cancer cells, and when these connections are severed, the cancer's growth can be halted. It's a startling revelation, one that opens up new avenues for potential therapies. This interaction between cancer and the nervous system isn't just a one-way street. Cancer can influence the brain region responsible for producing neurons, forcing these neurons to change their identities. It's a chilling thought, isn't it? The cancer not only hijacks the nervous system but also manipulates it to its own ends. But knowledge is power, and understanding this complex relationship between cancer and the nervous system offers hope. It's leading to the development of therapies that target these connections, providing a new weapon in our arsenal against this devastating disease. To summarize, the key points we've discussed are 1. The interaction between cancer cells and the nervous system was first observed in the 19th century. 1. Nerves actively seek connections with cancer cells, promoting their growth. One. Cancer can influence the brain region responsible for producing neurons and even change their identities. 1. Understanding these connections is leading to the development of new therapies to combat cancer. So, the next time you reflect on the marvels of the human body, spare a thought for the intricate dance between cancer and the nervous system. It's a dance of destruction and manipulation, but also one of hope and potential breakthroughs.